should hate speech be illegal? Yes. I don't think so. Could you tell me what hate speech is? Inciting hatred should be illegal, but I think people should be allowed to make their own mind up when it comes to speech. I feel like everyone's entitled to say what they want, and if I want to tell you you're wrong for that, I should be able to say that, you know? I don't think that anyone should talk down on anyone based on their age, race, anything of the sort. You know, if it's not directly affecting them, then they should just let them have their opinion. It's free speech for a reason. Hate speech should be illegal. Why? Why? Because it's like wrong. Like you shouldn't be like discriminating against people, right? Isn't that what it's about? To make it illegal is like we're taking and stripping something from someone. Should hate speech be illegal? Yes. I don't think so. Say what you got to say. If it incites violence and aggression, maybe not so much. It's terrible. Everybody's running around hating everybody and everyone's mad at everybody. And we're living in a toxic world right now. I do believe in free speech. I believe that we should be able to say what, what we want. However, you know, if it starts causing problems, you know, people, people start hurting each other. I, I think that's going too far. Is this tweet hate speech? There is no such thing as a trans man or a trans woman. However, there is a category for mental illness. Who is he to say that this person isn't who they say they are? Because without knowing anything about someone, he's categorizing them as mentally ill. It's like, it's not really, it's just freedom of speech. People are saying what they want. Well, like, you shouldn't be commenting on other people's beliefs. Like, if, like, they have a certain belief and you don't, you should just mind your own business. Like, you shouldn't, like, interfere with I don't think we should someone. say mental illness. Yeah, that's really But, I mean, up. I'm, I don't, that's I don't really complete, I don't completely support everything, but I wouldn't say that. That is hate speech, because you can't be calling someone a mental illness just because yeah, they're trans. Okay. Okay. There's no such thing. Do you think this tweet is hate speech? That, I don't think so. That's his thoughts. If you want to call it hate speech, yeah. If you're going to claim to be a Christian and claim to speak on these things, you got to be, come from a loving place, and that's not loving. If they want to, you know, change their gender, then I feel like that's their right. But at the same time, I feel like they should not be pushing it in on children. I feel like it shouldn't be anything taxpayer-funded. Because, you know, again, that's something that you want to do, you know. Okay, you... how about this tweet? Let me see. I am deeply impressed by the burning of the pride flag at a San Fernando Valley hate. That one is hate speech? Hate speech, hate speech. That, that one, yeah. That, because cause why? why? Why would you publicly, you know, parade, parade something like that? Yeah, no, that's, that, that's definitely hate speech. No flag should be burned. That is definitely... Uh, more hate speech. You should never have a positive comment about a negative action. The fact that somebody burned a pride flag and then someone had a positive comment about it, to me that would be hate speech. Absolutely. Posting something online, it's online. You, that's what the internet is made for. It's like it's, we also live in a country where no one cares about anything. You're celebrating uh, kind of just this like disrespectful act towards like another you know, group that you may not necessarily agree with. We live in a century where everything is offensive, mm -hmm. so we shouldn't say anything because anything would be offensive, but if anyone has their beliefs against like that, they just should keep it to themselves, but they just shouldn't support it, that's it. And what should the punishment be for this? None. I mean, putting him in jail is ridiculous. Um, I guess community service, hard community service, digging up roads. How many hours? Oh, hundreds. No punishment. They're rapists, they're murderers, they're people doing bad things. You know, like, to give someone a penalty for speaking how they want, boo, boo. What should the punishment be for hate speech? Oh, uh, a thousand lashings. What do you mean by that? Oh, uh, a thousand beatings, you know, just uh, like a severe beating. Are you being serious? Do you think they should actually get a beating? <laughs> no, seriously, yeah. <laughs> What do you think, like, the punishment should be for hate speech? I don't know, maybe, like, a fine or something? I wouldn't do anything. I wouldn't That's do anything. Up. They just need to, like, fix the way they say stuff and, like, not put it out there. If someone were to do this multiple times, they get a fine, two fines, three fines. What should, what should the next process be? I guess after, like, multiple, then, yeah, probably jail time sounds about right. And uh, how long would you have to stay in jail? I'm going to say months. And what do you think the punishment should be for that? I don't think there should be a punishment. I would have some kind of a ban. A person is able to say what they want to say. You know, one-time ban, make them 
do like what you would do if um, you know you got too many speeding tickets. They make right. you take a class. So you think it's okay for people to speak their mind, even if it is hate? You think it should be able to do that and suffer no consequences? No, I don't think anybody should suffer any consequences, even though they're talking about hate speech. But no it's, punishment. It's, it's, it, no, because it's, it's a person's opinion. I think you should be looking at introducing that person to a group that specializes in the area that they they hate and hopefully educating them. That Because if you're just going to punish someone without education, then that person's going to go out and feel exactly the same way and do exactly the same thing again. You're not educating anyone. What would the punishment be for for something like this in London? For that sort of language? Mm -hmm. There wouldn't be one on Twitter. It's freedom of speech. Get it together. This is like a hate world we live in now. And, you know, I'm older, and I remember when things were, you know, social media kind of ruined everything. But, you know, we love social media, of course. But it's, um, it's a tough world to live in now. You can't say anything or do anything without being criticized. <laughs>